Hi, um, my name is Michel van Oostenburgen. I'm producing synthesizer music under the name Sindel.nl and I'm using Sonar for about four years now. I was very excited when the V-Studio came out. Uh, it's perfect integration with, uh, with Sonar and it basically does all the functions that I need uh, when I'm working and it saved me a lot of time. Some features that are very uh, convenient for me were uh, some very simple things like the ability to save your product with just one click of the button, uh, of course the jog shuttle and, and uh, all the buttons here where you can instantly call up your console, your Synthrack, uh, very hands-on and uh, well, it, it, what I said, it saves me a lot of time. What I like the most about the console is uh, the easy navigation. Uh, I'm very fond of the jog shuttle, um, the ability to easily zoom and, and uh, work my way through my pro projects. And another feature that's, that's really cool and, and a lot of people uh, ask me what this lever is for, but it's the ability to put up your plugin windows very easily. Uh, I normally have a lot of screens open and a lot of plugins since and uh, with just fading them away I can instantly see my project again and work, work on from that. Um, of course, very easy to mute or solo channels. Uh, that's a function I use a lot. Um, and besides, uh, of course, the fact that you can easily scroll between your fader banks, uh, can lock faders and, and uh, just have the faders in place that you, uh, that you need at that moment. Um, one of my favorite functions is the undo function. I'm using that a lot, unfortunately, but it's, it's, it's great to have that uh, directly on your uh, control. And then um, the various uh, consoles, um, uh, screens you can open, like uh, Piano Roll that I use a lot, uh, the Synthrack that I use a lot. And uh, it's, uh, it's, it's very convenient to have that all uh, under your fingers uh, without switching to your keyboard or your mouse. In my productions in Sonar, I uh, usually start uh, with soft synths. Um, I use a lot of combinations between hardware and software, and I have a lot of hardware synths, but usually I start with some software, um, make the basis for the track. Uh, usually I start um, very soon using external uh, um, FX uh, equipment. Uh, for that I love the external insert that is uh, present in the recent versions of, of Sonar. Just with a twist of some knobs I can determine how much uh, of my signal is going in uh, to that reverb and coming out. So uh, delay compensation is perfect and, and, and for that uh, it's a breeze to use. And, and usually uh, when my track is building and building I start integrating more hardware and also use more hardware synths. Uh, like for example the Roland Vsync GT that I love for leads. And, uh, usually I start layering my pads with some analog synths and then all well, the truck starts to build and build and, 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 and I use uh, in the end usually about 50 tracks uh, on, on, on a single song and uh, also uh, like 8, 9 external uh, effects and uh, it all works perfectly and integrates perfectly so very happy with that. Well, about my music, it's, it's uh, synthesizer music in the traditional form. Um, in the 80s it was quite popular with um, my big influences like Jean Jojar, Vangelis, uh, Kraftwerk, Tangerine Dream. Um, I try to make it a bit, bit more uh, modern, my own, a bit my own style, of course. Um, but eventually, what I would like to do is make uh, uh, music for uh, documentaries, uh, movies. So it's it's more um, uh, music that that you can play in the background, uh, music that you can relax by, and um, yeah, it's of course based on synthesizers only and, and that's, that's uh, where the name SynthLNL came from as well. Well, the nice thing uh, about working in, in, in Sonar is that uh, when I start with my soft synths, uh, I record MIDI uh, from my keyboard here and uh, after that I can send that MIDI da data to any synth I like. Uh, all my old machines uh, also have MIDI uh, uh, on it, so it's very easy to use the data and, uh, and replay it on another synth. Um, but in the new stuff, uh, <clears throat> like the Phantom VS, it's, it's even nicer because uh, you have perfect integration in Sonar with all the controls at your hand and you can easily switch sounds. Um, but also from here I can play easily on my Fusion GT and, and uh, well, it's integrated perfectly in my digital setup so uh, I don't have to do any AD conversion or anything. A dream to work from, from my position here and, and be able to control all the machines in my, in my uh, studio.